Yum, yum! Floyd here with a quick example of using a collector, emitter, and moto, which can take particles from one simulation and move them to another simulation. In this example, I have a basic particle setup with particles colliding with a mesh. To work with a collector emitter, start by adding a particle operator to the schematic. Then use its add feature option to add a collision event. Then add a position read only. Next, add a collector emitter to the schematic. Connect the output of the particle operator to the operator channel of the collector. Then connect the collision event from the operator to the emit particle input of the collector. Use the add feature option for the collector to add position channels. Then connect the operator position to the collector position. To have the original particles removed on collision, connect the collision event output to the kill input. Create a new particle simulation in the schematic. Connect the collector to the particle sim operator's channel and adjust the color and size attributes. Compute the simulation to see the results. The collector emitter is such an open-ended controller, so be sure to explore the various feature assignments and schematic connections to take full advantage of this powerful option. Oh, look at the time.